As IPTL action continues in Manila, we bring you a world exclusive with world number six, Andy Murray. The Scot seems to be having a tough time adjusting to the IPTL format and isn't too fond of the tiebreaker rule, but he is optimistic about the future of this unique tournament. Here's the 2013 Wimbledon champion in conversation with my colleague Shivani Gupta. One of the biggest stars uh, to play in the IPTL is, of course, uh, former world number two, Andy Murray. Andy, enjoying the format, enjoying the team tennis and being out on the court? Yeah, it's been good fun. Um, you know, it's been a, quite a big adjustment um, from, what we're, from what we're used to. So, but, but it's been good. You know, it's, it's different. We play the same way all year round, same format um, for the last 10 years. So to do something like this is uh, it's good, it's challenging and um, the players are enjoying themselves. So that's, that's important. Yes, that's the key actually. The players themselves seem to be enjoying it quite a bit. You had a few laughs and egged the crowd on, uh, on the court. Uh, personally for you, as you said, very different from playing regular on the court. Yeah, I mean, you know, the, the crowd have been right into it and, you know, we've needed a lot of the support. We've struggled so, so far and, yeah, I hope, uh, hope tomorrow we can, we can do a bit better. But, yeah, like I say, it's been, you know, for the first time that the event's been on, I think it showed that it, it can work, that the players are, um, you know, very excited. You know, everyone's getting on well on the court and, you know, it's, it's nice to see. You don't, you don't see that in tennis um, really at all, sometimes during Davis Cup, but it's been, it's been good so far. You think so that this uh, format and this league can work then? I mean, for the players themselves also to come for three, four days in the off season, there's a future for a league like this? Yeah, I mean, I, I don't see why, you know, obviously for the players, as with it being the first year, we didn't know exactly how it was going to go. So not all of the players committed to, to play more than a few days. And, you know, with, with the way that it's gone this year, you know, maybe, maybe players will, will play a little bit longer. and. You know, I'm sure it will become more successful, you know, providing the, the players keep coming and the fans are enjoying it. So, um, yeah, hope it, hope it keeps going. How did you, uh, you know, prepare yourself for these matches? Is it as intense? Uh, do you take it as intensely as you would otherwise? Yeah, I mean, we, you know, we've been getting up and practicing in the morning to, to get ready. Uh, you know, but also before the match, because it's the match in the afternoon, we don't get to practice on, on the court. Um, so. You know, it's, it's quite a quite a quick turnaround, so that's been tricky. But yeah, I mean, you know, because of when it is in the calendar, a lot of the players are, have taken a break and then started training a few days beforehand. So there's a little bit of sort of rustiness there. Um, but you feel as intense on the court. You feel okay. I can't lose this one. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing when you're playing with with a team. You you want you want to win and you want to want to try and try and do well for your team. Finally, what do you make of the quirks in the rules, the PowerPoint, and uh, you know, t uh, timeouts and in playoffs and shootouts? Uh, those things add to the add to the fans' value. Yeah, I mean, I like it a lot. I mean, you know, all of the all of the different uh, ways of scoring and yeah, like you say that the PowerPoints and the timeouts are good. I, I don't like the, the tiebreak rule so much um, <clears throat> because it forces players to kind of rush and, and the quality of the tennis goes down a little bit. But ap apart from that, all of the other rules are a good fun. We'll miss you in Delhi, but thanks a lot for talking to us. Okay. All right, so that was Andy Murray playing for the Manila Mavericks. Uh, of course, he won't be in Delhi, but uh, we'll see some other stars like Roger Federer and others uh, playing for the Delhi team. Uh, for headlines today, Shivani Gupta in Manila.